We are divided. And why are we divided? Well, our president today is labeling 74 million Americans who voted for Donald Trump as something so horrendous I can't even use the term. We also see the White House spokesperson trying to convince us that our borders are secure. And that in fact, everything going on down there is by design. If the White House spokesperson believes our borders are secure, then by definition, she must believe this is by design, this is intentional. What we are seeing along our border, well, it's obviously a full-scale invasion of people who have no right to be in the country demanding entry to come in, make a phony asylum claim, get into the U.S. and remain indefinitely, being told, again, a lie, that if they're not successful in their asylum claim, they will be promptly removed. This is not only a lie, it underscores that the entire immigration system has become a fraud on the American people. But what's really important to remember here is what's coming across the border today is actually a trickle. It is, in fact, a very small part of a stream that is could be followed up by potentially hundreds of millions of people. When surveys are done around the world of people who would like to move to one of those wealthier Western nations like the United States, you find surveys showing 30, 40 to 50 percent of the populations finding it would be desirable, if possible, to move. Not surprisingly, people are coming across that border, not just from Mexico anymore or even the Northern Triangle, but from other countries in Latin America and even from all around the world. <music>